Good evening, Captain Matt Edwards here with another short video. I was just struck by the uh, implications of the uh, Canadian Forces Service Income Support Insurance Plan and the on-duty requirement for the uh, reservist. But when combined with the deemed salary of 75% of $2,700, which comes out to $2,025, that the injured in service reservist would get less than the off-duty regular force person. Now you tell me that's fair. If I was a captain and I reg force and I fell down the stairs at home, I would get 75% say of $90,000 and get $65,000 a year in CISIP. But if I'm a regular force captain and I get injured on duty and I get $2,025 a month, which is $24,000 a year, so a regular force person gets three times as much money paid under CISIP for an off-duty injury than a reservist hurt in service. This needs to be fixed. The fact that a reservist is treated less than a regular force person is highly inequitable. I don't have to prove that. All I have to do is point out the fact that Veterans Affairs last year gave the same earnings loss benefit to regular force and reserves because they said it was inequitable. Therefore, I don't have to prove it. I just had to point out that Canada admitted it.